I'm about to share with you three mistakes to avoid when trading up to a larger home. Before I get started, stay tuned for the end of this video where you can get an opportunity to order a free report entitled, Six Mistakes to Avoid When Trading Up to a Larger Home. Unlike the experience of buying a first home, when you're looking to move up and already own a home, there are certain factors that can complicate the situation. It's very important for you to consider these issues before you list your home for sale. Not only is there the issue of financing to consider, but you also have to sell your present home at exactly the right time in order to avoid either the financial burden of owning two homes or just as bad the dilemma of having no place to live during the gap between closings. Mistake number one is rose-colored glasses. Most of us dream of improving our lifestyle by moving into a larger home. The problem is that there's sometimes a discrepancy between our hearts and our bank accounts. You drive by a home that you fall in love with only to find out that it's already sold or that it's more than you are willing to pay. Most homeowners get caught in this hit or miss strategy of house hunting when there's a much easier way of going about the process. For example, find out if your agent offers a buyer profile system or house hunting service, which takes the guesswork away and helps to put you in the home of your dreams. This type of program will cross match your criteria with all available homes on the market as well as homes that you cannot find on the internet and supply you with information on a real-time basis. A program like this helps homeowners take off their rose-colored glasses and affordably and not miss out on the perfect home. Mistake number two, not selling first. You should plan to sell before you buy. This way you will not find yourself at a disadvantage at the negotiating table, feeling pressured to accept an offer that is below market value because you have to meet a purchase deadline. If you've already sold your home, you can buy your next one with no strings attached. If you do get a tempting offer on your home, but haven't made a significant headway on finding your next home, you might want to put in a contingency clause in the sales contract, which gives you a reasonable time to find a home to buy. Mistake number three, failing to get a pre-approved mortgage. Pre-approval is a very simple process that many homeowners fail to take advantage of. While it doesn't cost or obligate you to anything, pre-approval gives you a significant advantage when you put an offer in on a home you want to purchase because you know exactly how much house you can afford and you already have the green light from your lender. With a pre-approved mortgage, your offer will be viewed far more favorably by a seller sometimes even if it's a little lower than another offer that's contingent on financing. Don't fail to take this very important step. As promised, if you would like to get your free report on six mistakes to avoid when trading up to a larger home, please click on the link on the screen. And if you like this video, please subscribe and share it. We would also like your comments. If you would like to talk to us directly to find out how our home hunting service takes the guesswork out of finding just the right home that matches your needs, Give us a call at 720-463-0002. We look forward to hearing from you.